So welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Candy. I am a mom to five. On my channel, I share a lot of homeschooling, homesteading, gardening, Dan life, what's for dinner, canning, grocery hauls, all kinds of fun stuff. Um, today's video is a sponsored video from Out of Air. I'm so excited about this video because this product is something that I know that I will use. I've already kind of looked at some of it and I'm very thrilled with the quality of it. And this is some stuff that I think would be useful to anybody who has a garden or maybe has animals that they have processed and meat and all that fun stuff. Deer hunters, that would be another good thing this would be good for. But I am so excited to go and look through everything and show you guys everything. And then I'm going to give it all a try. So let's jump right into this. I'm going to start with this box. It's vacuum sealer bags. Let me show you guys. Can you see that? So there are two rolls of 8x25 and two of the 11x25 in this box. So we've got these, which are great for being able to kind of cut to the size that you want. So there's lots of those. And then the next one is the 100 vacuum sealer bags, and they are pint size, 6x10. Let me get that closer so it focuses. Let me see if I can get this one open and I'll show you how big these are. Again, these are something that I buy a ton of during the summer. I've never used this brand, but I felt them. They are very thick. They're great quality. They're four mils on the thickness, which is really good, but they come in these super good sealed packages so you know they're not getting wet or anything in shipping, anything like that if it rains on your packages. But... And then I already opened this one. I wanted to kind of check it out. It comes, can you see that? Let's see if it'll focus. It's a vacuum sealer roll and it is eight inches by a hundred foot. And it has a little cutter on here. You just pull it out to the length that you want. Like say, I want a bag that's this long. I'm gonna go a little longer actually. And then you just slide this across. and you have a perfectly cut bag. It's not uneven or crooked like it would be if you use scissors. But this one is the eight inch by 100 foot. See, there you go. And then this one I've not opened, it's the same, but it is 11 inch by 100 foot. And again, it just has the cutter already on it. So yeah, I've got a lot of options here for things that I can use. I'm so excited about these. I'm actually going to show you guys one more product, and it's the one I'm most excited about. The 50 zipper vacuum sealer bags, because I've never at Walmart or Bass Pro or any of the places that I normally would buy bags, I've never seen them with the vacuum, not vacuum, yeah, the vacuum bags with the zipper on them. That is something I've never seen and I'm super excited because a lot of the things that grow in my garden, if it's something that I package and I might only use a little bit, I usually use a Ziploc bag so that I can just pour some of it into soup or whatever I'm making and then they end up freezer burning because they were in a Ziploc bag. With this, you put your product in there, you zip it, and when you're ready to use it, you tear this off and you can just open your Ziploc and use the bag as a Ziploc bag. So I'm super excited about this. Things like squash and corn and things that, like I said, normally end up freezer burning on me by the end of winter will not because I've got these bags. So that's the one I'm most excited about. And they are one gallon bags. They're 11 by 16 and there's 50 in this box. So I'm super, super excited about these. I'm gonna give a few of these products a try. I've got some stuff that I needed to vacuum seal anyway. So I'm gonna give it a try on some rice, beans, and onions and kind of see how they work. The first thing I'm trying out are these pint-sized vacuum bags. I'm gonna put diced white onion in them, seal them up, and they'll be quick and easy to pull out, open up, and dump into taco meat, soups, whatever I may need them for.
Next, I'm going to try out these rolls with the built-in cutters. I'm super excited about these and how nice they will be to keep on the countertop during the summer to bring in veggies, get them cut up, sealed quickly, and into the freezer. Okay, now that I've tried the 8 inch, I'm going to try the 11 inch bags. Okay, the next bag I'm going to try is sealing up some pinto beans in this bag with the Ziploc edge. I am so excited about these bags. I canned about half of this bag of pinto beans for quick refried beans and things, but the rest of these I'm going to seal up dry because we might want to make a pot of beans later. And this way, all I have to do is open up that Ziploc, measure out what I need, and seal it back up. You guys, I am so impressed by these bags. I am very, very happy about them. Next, I cut off one bag from each of the rolls. I'm going to use these to seal up some rice. In the smaller bag, I'm going to do one cup of rice that I can just toss into soup or whatever I might need it for, and it'll be pre-measured. In the bigger bag, I put two cups of white rice with two tablespoons of tomato chicken bouillon and I'm sealing this up so I can just throw together a quick side dish one night with our dinner. It's already seasoned and ready to go. Okay guys, so I just spent the better part of an hour trying out all these products and I have to say that I'm in love with them. They are super thick, very good quality. I think Out of Air hit it out of the park with these bags. They are great. I think these are very good prices and very competitive with other brands as far as the pricing and the quality. I really like that these can be left on your countertop and they have the cutter and they're just quick and easy to pull out and use. So I really like those. This has been my favorite so far. I'm in love with the fact that there are Ziplocs on these. I can use these for garden produce. I can use them for rice, for beans, all kinds of things. Seal them up long term. And when I'm ready to use them, I can open the Ziploc, use what I want and put the rest away. 
So I'm in love with these. Um, but all together, I'm really impressed by all of these products and I'm gonna leave the link to this in the description box below, but they are called Out of Air Bags and their website is getvacbags.com. So I hope you guys will check them out and I'll see you guys next time with another new video. Bye.